Hey guys, how's it going? Oxmas here and welcome back to Union Cross. I'm going to be doing my free poll and then doing a high score challenge run on my main account. I'm going to try to see what the whole high score challenge is about. And then later on today, I should be doing a stream around 4 p.m. Eastern, maybe, if I got enough time uh, to do my free to play runs and see if we can get ourselves top 1,000 or at least top 5,000 or the score to get this uh, medal. Because uh, Mr. Well, Bob M. Jack Jack is actually a really good medal. It's got one of the highest multipliers in the game for upright. Uh, magic. Holy crap, man. Honestly, uh, sorry about that for a second. There was just this giant spider crawling across my light, and I just totally freaked out. Um, I might have to move out. <laughs> this spider belongs in this room. I am not dealing with that shit. I have no clue where it is, but we're gonna jump into this video, get it done with, and I'm gonna get the hell out of here. I'm done. Okay, let's go for our free pull. <laughs> She's gonna crawl up on me. Let's go for this free poll and see what I get out of this. So if you guys don't know, first poll's free. Best of luck to everyone. I hope you get amazing luck like I've been seeing on Twitter. Kyrie's, Shion, Kai's with multiple seven stars. It's just been incredible, the polls I've seen. So hopefully I get something incredible out of this. Come on. Ooh. Oh. Is that a seven star SP Vanitas? Damn. And Mr. Incredible which is a pretty good AoE, and misses Incredible, which is a really good metal. So we're only missing Violet. Are we supposed to get a 7-star out of this? Is it guaranteed 7 stars out of What is the draw odds on this? Let's go look this out. So we're guaranteed two uh, Incredible 2 medals, but I'm just curious about that Tier 5 there. I didn't really look at the banner. So according to the banner, I wasn't supposed to get that 7-star Tier 5, which is great. But also, like I said down below, you guys do have a chance of getting that Kyrie and Shion, Kai, and EX out of these pulls. Not a crazy high percentage, but they're there at 0.01226 and 0.58895%. You guys can see right there at the top of the list. Kingdom Hearts 2, Kyrie, EX, EX, and... Uh, the other EXs, so EX plus is Kai, basically. So, uh, if you guys are super lucky, you might get yourself some good AoE medals with some utility and uh, some buffers along the way, or like I did, and a 7-star. But I wouldn't go spending all your jewels on this banner because Organization 13 event's coming up very, very soon. Axel's around the corner. There's 15 days on this, and there's two weeks for that high score challenge. So, take your time. Take your time with it. We're going to go jump into the high score challenge real quick. I'm going to go look at the percentage medals because I haven't done anything. I, I just woke up about an hour ago. No, two hours ago. Uh, I was hanging around with Penelope the whole time. And then she just took her nap. So that's why I'm doing my recording right now. So I have no clue what's going on besides the update video I did last night. 21 enemies. So nothing special there. We get a, we get one of the Chippendales. That's good. 21% medals. Six stars and seven stars are worth the same. That is amazing. Oh, please continue this trend. Oh my god. All right. A free-to-play medal down here. So basically, it's all free-to-play if you really think about it. Um, I got myself a 21% medal. Oh, that job was lucky then. Even more luckier than I thought. So... Anyone that actually pulls this Roxas, you're going to have a great time right now. That's probably going to be your MVP right there. Um, but I'm going to try to go in with whatever I got right now. So I've got 14%, 14%, 10%, and 21% uh, along with the 7%. So let's try to make a Keyblade setup with all that and see what I can come out with this. Okay, so for now, I made myself kind of a funky Keyblade. I do have... Um, I do have myself a 40% trait metal still that I can put in the trade slot if I'm not going to pull anymore. And I do have myself a couple of Miguel and Hector sitting around. I haven't guilted mine. I didn't get to finish uh, the high, uh, the Union Cross, so I didn't really bother with it. Which turns out great. They all be 7% medals. That's another thing. You should never really fuse everything together until a high score challenge comes out. We didn't expect this one so soon, but it's here. So the only issue again with this is second chance. So I think for now, I might just throw a second chance on Miguel and Hector. Uh, just to make sure that I have some power there. So let's go throw that second chance on one of them. As long as I have multiple copies, I'm okay. Yeah, we'll just put a, a simple second chance over here. Since we got so many of them, and there's a banner that you can pull second chances every pull. So it's not a big deal. Um, so there you go. Let's jump into the high score challenge, see what we can do with this setup. My MVP is going to be my 7 star... Uh, what do you call it? 7 star illustrated invisible until I get more percentage. I want to go with invisible because we, we all know that with the L method, having that single hit is going to be a big game changer. Besides that, I have no other powerful medals on here. So currently I got 66% on my own. And then I'm going to take someone's um, illustrated Roxas that has the best stats 
I could possibly find. Hopefully some extra attack somewhere down the line. AB7, plus 1,000 ground. So two 1,000s, negative 60 ground. That's good. Uh, the Roxas looks good right now. This is also really good AoE metal as a 7-star. It's got that 24 multiplier I was talking about and even more with the 40% of Mr. Incredible getting that buff from the boosters. So the boosters have that buff as well. But we're looking at Roxas because Roxas, once there's one enemy, he can apply... A big amount of damage as well so no one with extra attack for now <laughs> let me just double check all that yeah nobody's got extra attack so I'm gonna go with Nicholas's uh, two 1000s and a negative 60 ground with AB7 max and I believe it's not boosted okay so it's not boosted that doesn't matter let's jump in with 87% and see what we can pull off now I don't know if enough. I don't know if I have enough strength here I definitely have my tier 4 fi oh wait two three paths okay MVP is going to be invisible and a magic, so we're going to go to the magic route and see what we can pull off here. I'm excited. Another high school challenge after a high school challenge, guys. You don't know how good this is to me. This makes me happy. So I'm going to use uh, Kairi Kai over here as my MVP for the beginning, just because she does so much damage. And my other MVP is so far away. This is going to be more of a, let me just put a bunch of percentage medals on a Keyblade and test this out. They're level 500s already. I could probably get away... No, because my Shion, I have my Shion set up so my uh, my visible gets a buff. Oh, I thought that was a portal for a second. I was just about to walk away. Okay, so first room cleared. We got 6,777,000. Triple sevens means pretty good luck right there. Uh, if you gamble, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Which this game basically is gambling at some points. We have 14 million now. So we need a total of 110 million to get... Uh, two of the invisibles, or sorry, Bob and Jack Jack, and a trait medal. I think it was 110 million. I think somewhere around this place, I should stop doing this. There we go. I might have screwed that up already, but it's a one hit medal. I don't think this is going to kill with 109. Pretty close though. And this is where I'm going to start using my MVP. Um, I probably could use it back there, but this is where I'm going to start. So this is where I'm going to get the most score possible. Because multi hit medals, if multiple hits land and only like three. Uh, out of your five hits actually connect with the enemy you actually lose score because of the multi hits It depends how powerful it is compared to another single target uh, But with my visible I shouldn't have to worry about that. So we're just gonna tap right through I, I probably could uh, This is where we got to look at like multi turns So we got those two bastards. I'm gonna hit one with the invisible and then the other ones I'm going to let HP recovery and second chance kick in. So that should be good. Because I want I want everyone to, to die by Illustrated Invisible to get the best score possible. That's what I'm going to pull off here. Or at least I'm going to try to. It looks like this little guy is dying already. I just got to be careful. So, with having my Illustrated Shion, I'm getting all the buffs and debuffs I need. The guy on top is dying. Who's got 147? The monkey, right? Okay, so I got to go for the bat. There we go. He's got 40 bars of HP. Now I can do a swipe here, another swipe, and not worry about the HP too much. I don't think so. But we got to rely on a second chance. One, to go off every single time for multiple enemies. Which I'm hoping that the rest of this isn't multi-enemies. If it is, I'm going to get kind of screwed over because second chance might not trigger. But with the level 1600 enemies, we are at 31,303,000 so far. Don't tell me it's a multi-group. It is a multi-group. Um, but a nat only two. There's only two here, which isn't bad at all. So we're going to go use our Shion again. And I'm going to take out the Sleeping Archer just in case I get put to sleep. And also, he's got less HP, so I don't want to mess around with this guy's HP too much. I don't know if I would kill that in one shot, to tell you the truth right now. I don't think I'd be able to kill that in one shot. So they have no counters on it, so that doesn't matter. I could, if this was a 7 star, I could be applying the 90% guilt. So once I make my Mr. Incredible 7 stars, I'll add that 90% instead of 80% will give me more damage. Um, but besides that, everyone that I activate has counters on their head, so it's not too bad. So for now, this is the strategy I'm going to go with. Until I make Mr. Incredible into a 7 star. My god, my MVP is ridiculous. Don't really need that. But we'll grab it anyway since it's there. Um, we are now at the camels. Two enemies, which is good. Um, maybe I'm just going to go for the buffs here. 
and to make sure that my medals kill these guys in one shot. So we're just gonna go for the swipes right now. Shion, and I think I'm gonna take out the camel first. Yeah, I'm gonna take out the camel first because I think I can do that in one shot. Pretty good, okay. And then for this guy, we're just gonna swipe. 19, 1960 with a little bit of Kyrie and Shion. His HP should be down and I should be able to take it out in one shot as well. So let's try that out. Here we go. I'm trying to look for the spider right now. <laughs> I just heard a noise. And I'm like, where the, where is it? Where is it? It's going to jump out of the ceiling or something. Watch. Jump down from the ceiling. It's going to get me. Halfway through this high score challenge, I'm going to be like, I got the medal. And then, whoops. Cross my fingers, that doesn't happen. All right, we're, I think we're halfway through. We are halfway through. Again, one enemy with 10,000 HP. I wonder if you can turtle all of this. Um, I don't think I'm going to be taking this guy out in one shot. So I'm going to let my medals play through. But I wonder if you can turtle this. So let's lower his attack by negative 7. And what do you do? You just add counter, so you're not that important. Okay. I'm just going to let auto battle play here because we have the full buffs and uh, debuffs we need. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no. Do I got enough damage on this Keyblade? With the friend medal, I think I do. Hopefully, this is the last enemy. We survived. We survived with Mrs. Incredible. That is perfect. What does is, what is, uh, Miguel and Hector do again? Peace and defense by one? Okay. Let's just play out the whole thing. Let's just play out the whole thing just in case. That is... That's incredible. That is incredible. Uh, sure, we'll just let this guy hit him for no reason at all. We got the SP for it, so it doesn't matter. Full auto battle. So I didn't use my HP recovery there, and I didn't use second chance. With defense boost, four max, and misses incredible. I survived a hit, uh, an attack from this enemy right here. So you guys could possibly do it. I might have more HP than... Okay, so we can turtle it. With one Mrs. Incredible, you guys can turtle it with Defense Boost 4 Max. So if you haven't bought those Avatar boards, you have a pretty good chance. And even more of a chance with Violet. So you don't have to be super powerful to pass this one. Which is good to know. I honestly thought I was going to die here because of that. But that is only level 5,000 enemy. Uh, only 5,000. 5,000 is pretty big. I'm not going to lie, alright? Uh, this might be the last guy. There might not be anything else after this. So I'm at 106 million. If there's no other enemy after this, I'm kind of screwed. I'm off by 4 million. I'm off by 4 million. Ah, oh, there's no one else here. There's no one else here. No! <laughs> oh, you can go up here? Well, that's new to me. I had no clue about that section right there. Anyways, uh, enemy? No, no, no mimic. Okay. So, with my percentage I got at the moment, if I pull one more time and get myself another 10% metal or a 21% metal I can make 110 million I think you need more I use the, my invisible as my MVP the most I can probably squeeze out with this setup is probably 107 million maybe 108 million if I'm lucky but I did a pretty good job using my visible on the majority of the enemies so it looks like you need a good percentage off this somewhere in the 90s maybe what, what was I sitting at 87 I think 87, so this might be another 95% high score challenge. 95%. 90 to 94%. Depending on your MVP, your Keyblade, your attack boost and all that stuff. Because I'm sitting with 87% and we got that score. So, if I pull myself... I could uh, rearrange it where I take out this metal right here. Um, add my Kyrie trait metal into the pet slot and go for the divine rose and put the divine rose over here so i might not need to pull anymore i might just go ahead and switch up um this over there you know what i'm gonna do that right now i'm gonna go for another run through and i'll let you guys know the result
All right, well, there we go. That is the final hit right there, which equals 110 million on the dot. On the dot, pretty much. We just made it by uh, over, what, 175,000. We're about to get a little bit more off here. If that doesn't kill that off the Kyrie, that equals only 190,989 over the score that I needed. So with this setup that I use, I don't know if Invisible uh, really made a big difference or not. I'm going to find out when I use, do my free-to-play count. But main account, I got 110 million, and I got two of them. So now my next goal is to probably pull a little bit more, make some of these seven stars to have myself... Um, wait, no, I don't need to make them seven stars, but I need to have you don't even have a, you don't even need to have enough damage You can just oh, this is gonna be a hard high score challenge guys Because you don't even need uh, invisible there. So that is the high score challenge for my main account guys I will be doing the free to play count later on Hopefully I get as well at least 110 million, but I think it's gonna take a little bit more polls on that one uh, I might pull a little bit more on this account as well because I do want to hit that top 1000 so I'm going to try to see if I can pull maybe some other 21% somewhere. But that is it for this. Uh, <laughs> was that slim? It was slim. <laughs> this is a pretty easy high score challenge. I know I say that right now when I use two Kai medals. I understand that. But I think even with the guaranteed pulls and six stars and seven stars at the same percentage, a lot of free to play players should be able to grab a copy of that six star at 110 million. When I do my free to play count, I'll go over the strategy. But for now, guys, if you want to leave anything down below to help, the, help out the community to reach 110 million, and if I survive from the spider attack, um, I'll be doing that free to play run to help you guys out as well. If you did enjoy the video, don't forget to hit the like button. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Keep on smiling, and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, where the hell is that little ship? Where are you?